Just... But, but in, you know, because I've been in this position, too, with hands like Ace Jack on the small blind, everybody's folded to you, and I understand exactly what you mean about being slightly concerned about putting that raise in there, but surely with Ace Jack, you're going to kind of oh. want to hope the guy takes it as a steal, reshoves, and then call. Right. Yeah, you'd think they got this far and that they would had these situations plenty in the last three or four hours, but uh, maybe final table nerves. <clears throat> My final table nerves maybe just getting in the way a little, and it's easier to... To shove it all in and absolve yourself of any responsibility. Sure. A little frog in the throat there, Dan. I have. Oh, Got you to bed a bit early this morning, <laughs> I'm afraid, for PKR TV. Always a bit rough. Interesting flop for both. Well, for Show Me Your Money. Is well, it Show Me Your Money? It's, show Me Your uh, Nuts, sorry. <laughs> Which one would you prefer? <laughs> money, please. <laughs> it's so tough for the sevens here. So very tough to play out of position with three overs. Takes a remarkable bit of play here to uh, to put another 20 or 30 in. Yeah, and Trucker uh, in there betting with just 10,000, though, into a pot of uh, 93,000. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be... Uh, yeah, you see, I think that... What are you going to do on the... If you're going to call another 20 grand on the... Ten, well, he's not. Now he's yeah. done. Unfortunately, it would have, it would have been nice to see a deuce and to see if Trucker follow through, but we never shall. Well, tr it's interesting. Trucker makes the same bet having hit, uh, gets the fold with it this time, but... Um, Maybe just a bit of rope a dope there for Trucker. Ooh, little devil down to 6,628 chips. Miracle comeback for him. Yeah, Is it in the cards? Pretty. It's not looking pretty, I tell you. Maybe a triple up. I'll tell you what, I don't know what they call it when you've got half a big blind left. <laughs> Screwed. There's, there's the red zone, and maybe that's the day glow electric on fire pink zone or something. Something along those lines. And perhaps the brown and swirling zone. <laughs> Let's stop there. Cool. <laughs> Flat call from Basiltro with 10 kings suited. And guaranteed flat call from from the fat boy. Yeah, and he doesn't know it yet. but the, oh, 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 my word. Out Outrageous. Dan, your psychic abilities seem to be... I'm so way off. Yeah. More coffee for Dansky. He's not even a fat boy either. Did you see? He was totally skinny. All in from Little Devil with 5'9". Oh, Here comes the five, but it's not word. even live because of uh, Rebel's yeah. King five. But do you know what? The seven, eight of diamonds wouldn't have minded that flop too badly. Not in the least. Forgot about those cards, yeah. but I'm sure the guy who, hold, who held yeah, them did. Mm. Oh, look at that. The King five got chased yeah. off. So Little Devil stays alive and wins the hand. He's going to love that when he sees it on TV. Bazultra, if he hadn't bet there, King five would have stayed in, knocked uh, Little Devil out of there. As it stands, he's... Uh, well, that is somewhat of a surprise, and the 7-8 yeah. would have taken the whole thing, Adam. so... It's going to be uh, interesting to see how things turn out for Little Devil as the uh, tournament progresses. He was uh, as good as out of this thing after the flop with uh, King 5 do had him dominated. That sure is a mighty reprieve, and he'll never know quite how lucky he was, actually. A, a simple $10,000 call pre-flop with the 7-8 of diamonds, which uh, I would say more than half of the humans in the world would have played. Sure. This half of the human race well, certainly would have. I love those cards. I reckon so. But there we go. It just shows there are a million different routes you can go down in any tournament, in any sit and go. Crazy. And one man stays alive when perhaps he shouldn't. Absolutely. And show me your nuts. All in with uh, Ace 8. And uh, as uh, Brett Antill pointed out in a recent show, whenever you see that Ace and uh, the other car hit card hidden, Pretty safe bet that uh, that other card's a raggy. <laughs> yeah, a I've raggedy never... rag. Yeah, I guess. Might be another ace. You never know. Ah, oh, that's true. But I doubt it. Oh, fouled. Ace eight suited again. This mm. time for Trucker. I would happily forgive Trucker for laying it down here. He's just got that wrong amount of chips. Yeah, there you go. You see, he didn't want to put thirty in because he knows if someone shoves. He can't really call 110. Yeah, and when you say that min raise with his stack is kind of announcing early that he's going to fold to anything heavy, which yeah, I think he will do here. I'd be amazed if uh, if he called, but then I have been wrong 100% of the time today. Well, and I hope he does fold because it's the right move. We, you know. Yeah. Should happily ignore pot size here. It's totally irrelevant. You know you're in trouble. Absolutely. I'd, li I'd like to see a Trucker what with a big win here. Maybe he could afford a new hat. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. I wonder whether he uh, he would have thought about the ace eight. You know, the fact is, I've got to be honest, if it was not suited, do you think he would have min-raised?
Well, uh, you know, yeah, you and James are, are fond of talking about people overrating uh, their suited hands. It's just 3%. That's all it is, folks. Three tiny percents. And it gets you into so much more trouble than those extra 3% so the, give you the, 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 the suited hand is 3% more likely to win than the unsuited hand. Is yeah, it, it is. So... Uh, I don't know. I think early position, you got to you got to see it as essentially a raggy ace. So there's no value in raising with that from early position for my mind. But well, and the the thing that I would have said uh, too is oh, is yeah. the there's the hand before oh, we saw exactly the same hand ace eight suited all in pre oh, mm. and take the blinds. Yeah, there's no harm in that. Um, you know, but the min raise it just it screams weakness, and when you're actually weak. Trucker here with another decision with his pocket queens all in. Wow, and this is going to be a nice chunky pot. Yep. Show me your nuts needs a five to survive. Let's see a beat. And here comes Six, seven. No. Nope. Here comes the river. Nope. Dan, psychically wrong again. Yeah, but that's only because I'm choosing outrageous outcomes. Sure, he's ta he's taking the long odds. Uh, <laughs> I'm, sh I'm sure Trucker09 won't mind that he was wrong. That knocks him up to second place. Show me your nuts. That sends him home in eighth place. With uh, I can't quite see him from here. How much money did, does he take home? Yeah, six bucks shy of 500. So, uh, you know, not so bad. But we always say that we're, that uh, you should, I guess, generally be disappointed unless you've played a short stack with one big blind from 40 left down to the final table. In which case, you'll thank your lucky stars you even got there. But yeah, I don't know. Yeah, sure, interesting hand here. But I agree. If yeah, you know, who knows? Maybe he was maybe he was nearly out of it in 50th. Yeah, and he's thrilled with that money. But uh, limping from the button. I love it. Absolutely, fat love boy flex. In behind with the ace jack suited. It's funny that the ace-10, again, this is another time when if it was unsuited, no one likes ace-10 offsuit. I've never met a man in the street or otherwise who likes ace-10 offsuit, unless you're playing heads up. Sure. But he should be a little worried now. The only thing is he's backed himself into a corner because once you've limped on the button, you it might well be someone pouncing on your weakness. They don't sure. realise that you were trapping. So it's the trapper and the trappy, and who knows which one is which. <laughs> the trapper and the trappy, and third hand in a row that Trucker's involved in that's a little bit difficult for him. And I've got to say, I'm amazed. If you raise out of position pre-flop, the, generally, the laws of poker suggest you should follow up, come what may, on the flop. Fat, you're talking about Fatboy Flex's oh, check there. To, absolutely. To oh, and unless it's a trap check, and it definitely is not, because he's only got 111, so he couldn't really be wanting to check raise there. That And he's folding. He, he's check folding after raising. I mean, he might as well have called in the big blind or, or, or checked, you know? Well, and he... And he True to your word, he did kind of hand a lot of chips over to Trucker there with the better hand, despite having the better hand. You, you want to go after the chips after the flop when you get an eye, rough idea of where you are. He didn't really give himself an idea there. He put himself in a... I, I rather like the move pre, but I rather did not like the move on the flop. At least lead out for half the pot, you know? He had 111 grand. I don't know... Actually, it would have been a quarter of the pot or a third. But, you know, good enough. <laughs> good enough. Our mass is bad today. We're gonna, but, yeah, we're going to get Dan a calculator for the yeah. next show. But I, I, I think I think everybody knows what you're, what you're on about yeah. and gets the idea. Have a little stab. And you know what? If you get caught, back off. That's fine. No shame there. Absolutely. Interesting that the guy from last time, oh. Fat Boy, is now the one limping from the button too. He, he uh, didn't okay. see that uh, the guy on the button last time had the advantage by doing that, and he's doing the same. Oh, I guess he did. What on earth am I talking about this morning? Little and devil flops two pair. That's yeah. going to be hard to spot for everyone else. Well, this is a cooler in in uh, many ways. <laughs> and oh, what's little? Oh, little devil shoves. Oh. Well, he's only got eight thousand chips left, so I guess no harm in that. Gets I the insta call, insta call from Fat Boy <laughs> Flex, and the things continue call. to go well for the little devil. Final I don't want to jinx. Yeah, no, he's. Uh, Three six and he and he did it before with seven five I believe six and a half grand to fifty two and a half grand. So from uh, being he had at one point folks he had six thousand chips left with the blind.